May these verses bring you comfort, assurance, and a deep sense of peace in your mind and heart. Isaiah 26 verse 3, Thou wilt keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on thee, because he trusteth in thee. John 14 verse 27, Peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you, not as the world giveth, give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid. Philippians 4 verses 6 to 7, Be careful for nothing. But in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your requests be made known unto God. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Psalm 29 verse 11, The Lord will give strength unto his people, the Lord will bless his people with peace. Matthew 11 verses 28 to 30, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you, and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest unto your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Psalm 34 verses 17 to 18, The righteous cry, and the Lord heareth, and delivereth them out of all their troubles. The Lord is nigh unto them that are of a broken heart, and saveth such as be of a contrite spirit. Romans 8 verse 6, For to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. Isaiah 12 verse 2, Behold, God is my salvation, I will trust, and not be afraid. For the Lord Jehovah is my strength and my song, he also is become my salvation. Psalm 94 verse 19, In the multitude of my thoughts within me thy comforts delight my soul. Colossians 3 verse 15, And let the peace of God rule in your hearts, to the which also ye are called in one body, and be ye thankful. Proverbs 14 verse 30, A sound heart is the life of the flesh, but envy the rottenness of the bones. Psalm 55 verse 22, Cast thy burden upon the Lord, and he shall sustain thee, he shall never suffer the righteous to be moved. John 16 verse 33, These things I have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace. In the world ye shall have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. Psalm 16 verse 8, I have set the Lord always before me, because he is at my right hand, I shall not be moved. Isaiah 26 verse 12, Lord, thou wilt ordain peace for us, for thou also hast wrought all our works in us. Matthew 6 verse 34, Take therefore no thought for the morrow, for the morrow shall take thought for the things of itself. Sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. Philippians 4 verse 19, But my God shall supply all your need according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus. Psalm 119 verse 165, Great peace have they which love thy law, and nothing shall offend them. Romans 15 verse 13, Now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing, that ye may abound in hope, through the power of the Holy Ghost. Psalm 29 verse 11, The Lord will give strength unto his people, the Lord will bless his people with peace. Psalm 27 verse 1, The Lord is my light and my salvation, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life, of whom shall I be afraid? Isaiah 41 verse 10, Fear thou not, for I am with thee, be not dismayed, for I am thy God, I will strengthen thee, yea, I will help thee, yea, I will uphold thee with the right hand of my righteousness. Psalm 119 verse 50, This is my comfort in my affliction, for thy word hath quickened me. Psalm 119 verse 105, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet, and a light unto my path. 
John 16 verse 13, Howbeit when he, the Spirit of truth, is come, he will guide you into all truth. For he shall not speak of himself, but whatsoever he shall hear, that shall he speak, and he will show you things to come. Romans 8 verse 28, And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are the called according to his purpose. Psalm 62 verses 1 to 2, Truly my soul waiteth upon God, from him cometh my salvation. He only is my rock and my salvation, he is my defense, I shall not be greatly moved. Philippians 4 verse 8, Finally, brethren, whatsoever things are true, whatsoever things are honest, whatsoever things are just, whatsoever things are pure, whatsoever things are lovely, whatsoever things are of good report, if there be any virtue, and if there be any praise, think on these things. Psalm 119 verse 130, The entrance of thy words giveth light, it giveth understanding unto the simple. Romans 5 verse 1, Therefore being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. Psalm 37 verse 4, Delight thyself also in the Lord, and he shall give thee the desires of thine heart. Psalm 119 verse 143, Trouble and anguish have taken hold on me, yet thy commandments are my delights. Isaiah 26 verse 12, Lord, thou wilt ordain peace for us, for thou also hast wrought all our works in us. 2 Thessalonians 3 verse 16, Now the Lord of peace himself give you peace always by all means. The Lord be with you all. Psalm 119 verse 165, Great peace have they which love thy law, and nothing shall offend them. Matthew 6 verse 25, Therefore I say unto you, Take no thought for your life, what ye shall eat, or what ye shall drink, nor yet for your body, what ye shall put on. Is not the life more than meat, and the body than raiment? Psalm 56 verse 3, What time I am afraid, I will trust in thee. Isaiah 26 verse 3, Thou wilt keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on thee, because he trusteth in thee. John 14 verse 1, Let not your heart be troubled, ye believe in God, believe also in me. Romans 15 verse 13, Now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing, that ye may abound in hope, through the power of the Holy Ghost. Philippians 4 verses 6 to 7, be careful for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving let your requests be made known unto God. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Psalm 37 verse 7, Rest in the Lord, and wait patiently for Him. 2 Corinthians 1 verses 3 to 4, Blessed be God, even the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies, and the God of all comfort, who comforteth us in all our tribulation, that we may be able to comfort them which are in any trouble, by the comfort wherewith we ourselves are comforted of God. Isaiah 55 verse 12, For ye shall go out with joy, and be led forth with peace. The mountains and the hills shall break forth before you into singing, and all the trees of the field shall clap their hands. Matthew 11 verse 28, Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Philippians 4 verse 13, I can do all things through Christ which strengtheneth me. Psalm 119 verse 105, Thy word is a lamp unto my feet, and a light unto my path. John 16 verse 33, These things I have spoken unto you, that in me ye might have peace. In the world ye shall have tribulation, but be of good cheer, I have overcome the world. Colossians 3 verse 15, 
And let the peace of God rule in your hearts, to the which also ye are called in one body, and be ye thankful. Philippians 4 verse 19, But my God shall supply all your need according to his riches in glory by Christ Jesus.